Um, I'm John Prosser. Uh, 12 years old, parachute. I had four hard landings. Uh, three of them impacted on my back. That just caused a, had a cycle of uh, back problems, niggles, that over time the frequency increased and the severity increased. I had to start using a wheelchair to get about and it left me really crushed uh, physically, mentally. Uh, I wasn't a really good person to be around. It has a massive effect on your family, your wife, your children, and I put a lot of weight on. Um, so by the time April 2014 came along, I was 21 stone eight. Yeah, that's when I sort of realised a bit of a mess. <laughs> <laughs> and I started to realise the sort of state I was in. And I went along to the uh, wheelchair spectacular at uh, Cardiff uh, Met University and going past Welsh Road a couple of times. They were a very cheerful open bunch. Um, they were very keen to, to, to accommodate me, to get me onto an ergo, to find out which one was more suited to me. Um, one of them was very kind to, to offer to race me and, I, and uh, unfortunately for her, I, I thrashed her. <laughs> they were very quick to place me with um, Landaff Rowing Club, um, who gave me the facilities to be able to train on a regular basis. Between Welsh Rona and Landa Rowing Club, they've made it a very easy path. We want to develop at Welsh Rowing a, a pathway for para rowers. Uh, we want to raise the profile of para rowing and make, make sure that people know how accessible a sport it is and to increase the number of para rowers so that more and more people enjoy our sport. Uh, competitive by nature, extremely. Remember the first competition I done uh, last year? Welsh Indoor Rowing Championships. Got a gold there. That sort of got a bit more of a hook in me. I then went to the British Rowing Indoor Championships and managed to get a silver there. I was a bit annoyed. Um, <laughs> but, but having only been doing it for, for two months at that time, I was quite pleased. My next big challenge of rowing, uh, would, it's going to be the Invictus Games. Go out there, uh, compete hard, uh, see if I can come back with a couple of medals, which would be very nice. <laughs> so the next stage for John is obviously uh, after the Invictus Games, we hope to get him out on the water. Uh, I know he can't wait to get out on the water and hopefully then we can get him going to some uh, races on the water as well, which would be great to see him again building on that confidence that's grown massively in the last few months. Getting back out and sculling on the water would be one of my next objectives and then would be to try and see if I could take that to a higher level. Later this year then we'd go back to the British Road Indoor Championships and see if I can come away with the gold. I found that rowing has, to a certain extent, put my life back into perspective. It has definitely helped me to focus more on the positive things in life. With, without the support of Welsh rowing, I wouldn't have been fit enough uh, and mentally fit enough and physically fit enough to be able to go forward. Don't waste time looking back, just keep looking forward. <laughs>